Hello everyone. This is Rashid Kibria from Fixed Research University of Florida. Today I will provide a demonstration of my epistemic solitaire tool on analyzing a complex I2C controller core from open codes. This controller core has total two epistems and all of the two epistems are encoded using one hot encoding scheme. One epistem has total 18 state flip-flops and the other one has uh, six state flip-flops. You will find the FSM Salter tool inside gate. And here I will select the FN version of FSM Salter. This FN stands for Flatten Netlist. So this version of FSM Salter can analyze the flattened gate level netlist of a certain RTL design. The first task you have to load the technology library in .lib file. So in .lib format, and you can find it inside GL FSM Salter folder. And here, uh, if I uh, clear now the window, so yeah, I will delete the previous reports and I will now select this library in .lib file. Then I will provide the technology library in .b format. And finally, I will read the flattened gate level netlist. So we can find it inside inputs. And this is the file. Uh, the last task, we have to add the FSM extraction reports from RTL FSMX. And uh, I also provide them. Then you can select the extract control FSMX button. It will start running the tool automatically. The process has already finished. It is so fast. And the GLSTG extraction is also complete. Now you can view the uh, extracted netlist. Uh, the FSM minimum extraction. So you can find, uh, you see this I2C underscore report folder has been created. And here you will see a uh, netlist uh, folder. And inside, uh, this one is the file for FSM minimum extraction region. And this one uh, is the pure uh, combinational state transition logic. So if I uh, select the first one and I hit open, uh, this is the byte controller FSM of this I2C module. This FSM has total six states and all of them are encoded using one of encoding scheme. So there are total six straight flip-flops. The other FSM has total 18 uh, straight flip-flops and that, that is the very big FSM. So uh, this, uh, uh, all of these two FSMs have a very uh, complex strategy. The reason is that the number of state transitions is extremely high. Now, so, uh, and uh, uh, therefore, uh, the SVG report in gra graphical format is also not viewable. Uh, but uh, you see, the tool has already generated these two files, but you cannot uh, view it because it is uh, the size of the FSM is so huge. But I can show you the SVG in text format. So I select that and I hit open. Uh, it is the state transition graph of the first control FSM of FSM underscore one. And this uh, stray, um, this FSM has total 109 uh, straight transitions, which are extracted by FSMS Ultra. FSMS Ultra can successfully recover uh, the control flow, which, which was specified in the RTL abstraction uh, in the, uh, from the flattened gate level version. So it contains not only the RTL uh, straights, but also uh, additional hidden don't care states and also the extra transitions. The RTL strategy, which can be extracted uh, using RTL FSMS, that is uh, basically a subset of this gate level strategy. So you can also use uh, FSMS Ultra report uh, to show the equivalence um, you know, of you know, two FSMs in RTL abstraction and in gate level netlist abstraction. That is a, now that also helps to uh, verify your uh, FSM after logic synthesis as well. There is another uh, STG which has much more uh, straight transitions. It has total 764 uh, straight transitions. I have already counted that, and uh, this one is that part. It is coming from the FSM which has total 18 states, and so 18 straight flip flops. Uh, and uh, if you look here, uh, it has a large number of uh, state transitions and uh, lots of uh, things are happening here. 
Now, and uh, now you see the destination state, and here is the source state, and there is also another uh, file which represents all the state transitions with more information. That means it not only tells uh, about the state transitions, but also uh, for which conditions this certain transition has happened, and uh, it is uh, kind of shown here. So this one is the source state, this one is the destination state, and these are all the uh, state transition conditions, and there are a total of 42 conditions for uh, uh, for this state transition from this state uh, to this one. This one, uh, this file, which provides the SDG with more verbosity that gives you a lot of information of the FSM states and also uh, the uh, regions for uh, why certain transition occurs. Uh, and it also reports the total number of uh, inputs that you can apply here. This was uh, obtained uh, using ATPG based analysis. And after, after that, um, um, the gate level SDG extractor tool analyzed that and show and extracted all the information from there. Analyzing the ATPG uh, report generated by Synopsis Tetramax. You can also use a Synopsis Testmax as well. Uh, so Testmax is the uh, most recent version of uh, the Tetramax tool. Uh, it is also doable. I have already drawn it, uh, so it is also running perfectly, no issues. Uh, so um, that is how FSMS Ultra analyzed a complex I2C controller core from opencourse.org. Thanks for hearing.